Budget airlines are a cheap way to travel the world, but when there's a change of plans, getting a refund can be a headache. A survey from Taiwan's Consumers Foundation shows that low-cost airlines generally have poor guarantees for cancelled flights. Two out of the ten carriers have a no-refund policy. Another six give back nothing but the airport tax on cancelled economy seats. The consumer watchdog said that these policies are unreasonably strict. It's urging new rules on refunds to protect passengers' rights. The rise of budget airlines in recent years has allowed many to travel the world at a low cost. But cancelling tickets and getting a refund can be a tedious process. It's a bit unreasonable. If something comes up and you can't go, you should at least be able to return the ticket. To take advantage of these cheap prices, this is a risk you have to face. The Consumers Foundation carried out a survey on 10 budget airlines. Jetstar and Vietjet Air have the strictest return policies, with neither allowing a refund for cancelled flights. Six of the airlines only allow airport tax refunds for economy passengers. First class passengers are eligible for more reimbursements, albeit with restrictions. In unusual circumstances like natural disasters or terrorist incidents, they may allow you to return the tickets, but they give you refunds in the form of airline miles or vouchers with expiration dates. And the refund terms and conditions are applied case by case, so they may as well have not written them down. This is in violation of the Consumer Protection Act. Act. Data shows budget airlines carried over 10 million passengers last year, making up 18.7 percent of total passenger travel. The Consumers Foundation calls on the government to regulate the refund policies of global carriers to protect the rights of passengers.